to my channel. Welcome if you are new. My name is Emily. I'm a mother of three beautiful boys, ages three, two, and one. My youngest just turned one on Saturday and I am a mess, but it's kind of cool saying that my kids are three, two, and one. I don't know, it's kind of cool. You see the trampoline in the background? That is where we have our kids' playroom. It's supposed to be a dining room, but we got three kids. Yeah, who needs a dining room? I want a dining room, like in the new house that we're getting built, we have a like a formal dining room and then we have like a breakfast area. So I want to have a dining table in there because I actually do want to start eating at the table because right now we eat at the island and the boys eat at their little desks and obviously Monte eats at his high chair. Anyways, so today we went to Walmart. I had my husband pick up the order when he got off of work because he works at from 11 to 7.30. So. I had him pick it up when he got off of work. So this is a $200 haul and prices have gone up. I've noticed at least in our area, I don't know about everybody's, but so for example, we used to spend a dollar and eight cents on this, just a can of olives. And now we spend a dollar 26 and it's not like a huge difference, but it's noticeable enough to where it adds up, especially when you're doing larger hauls which to some this isn't a large haul and actually to me it's not even a large haul it's just to get us through till we go to sam's club this is definitely not going to last a month it's not even going to last two weeks so anyways stay tuned for the sam's club haul because those are my favorite and they make me happy and i love them <laughs> all right let's go ahead and get right into it if you haven't subscribed already i would appreciate you to subscribe like comment and just interact with me talk to me i like talking to y'all so Let's get right into it. I'm sure you're gonna see a lot of toys in the background, so just bear with me, it's the morning and I'm not awake yet, I haven't even had my coffee, so just just bear with me, y'all. All right, we got some saltine crackers. We had chili the other night and we didn't have saltines and we were not happy. So, we got some saltine crackers. Okay, you guys are gonna think I'm crazy for all the pasta, but the pasta is actually for the entire month. Everything else is not gonna last a month, but pasta actually will. But for our family, we have to have one and a half to two boxes to feed us all and if we want leftovers definitely two to three boxes so yeah it's a lot of pasta but it's gonna last us for hopefully a month <laughs> so we got two penne three four four rotini those are what we make with the chicken bacon ranch alfredo bake yeah we use the rotini for that so that's probably about that's probably about two of the meals with maybe one thing of leftovers we got four rigatoni that's what we have for the boys lunches and we got three three pound things of elbow macaroni you can't go wrong with elbow macaroni you can do elbow macaroni and ketchup you can do mac and cheese you can do you know everything everything in anything that you use regular pasta for you can use that macaroni for so can't go wrong with that we got some original restaurant style tostinos and if you don't have those ones and you usually get like a different brand, I would definitely recommend trying those ones. They're a little bit more expensive, but they're really good. Like they're thin and they're, I don't know, they're really good. They literally taste like the restaurant style, at least the restaurants that I go to, so. We got some Popables. Again, if you haven't tried Popables, I'd recommend them. I like them, they're good. They're, you're probably not really getting what you pay for because they are pretty much, the bag is air. I mean, you're spending 250 on air but the little bit of food that you do get out of it is good, so. I got some jumbo shells for, I wish I would've got another box actually, but I use it for um, buffalo stuffed shells. They're really good. I need to do a video on those because they're so bomb. My mouth is so dry right now, guys. Okay, I got one thing of fettuccine. I really don't know why I got only one thing of this. Like, that's just silly. I got a two pound box of, it's cheaper if you get the bigger boxes in bulk. So I got the two pound thing of uh, spaghetti. And then I guess I got this too. To the wise, don't order your food at one in the morning cause you will be getting double. I've gotten so much double of stuff, like a bigger version and then a smaller version. Cause like I got the smaller version originally and then I'm like, oh wait, you know, I kind of need a bigger version. So I got the bigger version and then I just kept the smaller version in the car. Yeah, don't do a grocery haul late at night just don't please don't for me don't and hydrate because my mouth is dry 
let's get right to it. Well, let's get back to it. Okay, mouth is hydrated. So, like I said, we got the medium olives, $1.26, used to be $1.08, kind of bummed out about that, but gotta get them. I think, I thought I got two cans of that, too. I guess not. Okay, so we got the Hormel No Beans. I do not like beans. They do not like me. So, got the No Beans. Isn't it weird the No Beans are more expensive than beans? The beans, the ones with beans is $1.96. These are $2.28. Isn't that weird? I find that weird. I mean, it's like less. I don't know. Anyways, I got real bacon bits. Gonna get the big thing. Oopsies. Gonna get the big thing from Sam's Club because I really have bacon bits and everything that I can. We got milk chocolate when one of the boys go poop on the potty. I know TMI, if you don't wanna hear this part, skip forward. But when one of the boys go poop on the potty, they get a piece of chocolate. And that's just how we potty train. So if you don't like giving your kids chocolate, don't do this way. But if you want your kids potty trained and you're okay with giving them chocolate, I definitely recommend it because it makes them excited about going potty. So just a tip. We got some Hungry Jack mashed potatoes for a quick dinner. We actually had this last night because, like I said, we didn't have any groceries in the house. So, But we had this. So we had this with chicken and green beans and, mat and um, gravy. So it was really actually pretty good. We got mozzarella. They substituted this. Originally, it was a 12 count. Now it's a 24 count. Thank you, Walmart. I appreciate you. Got some fudge brownies. I always get fudge brownies just so we can have a snack. The boys get excited about it. I get excited about it. Franny gets excited about it. So everyone's excited. Got marinara sauce. I don't remember getting this, but like I said, late night. I don't know. I guess I got that. Got some pizza sauce. I'll show you for what that's for later. I'll actually put that over there. I guess I got some more pasta sauce. Got traditional pasta sauce. Some syrup, we were running low on that. Gonna get a bigger thing from Sam's, but we need it now. Two things of Annie mac and cheese. Three things of Regu classic Alfredo. This is what we use for the chicken bacon ranch Alfredo bake and just the regular Alfredo. We got some white cheddar cheese sits Me and the boys love this stuff, so. And then we got some Ritz crackers. And if you see, my husband is the one that picked up the groceries, hence the Reese's being open. Yes, I got them for him, but I did not want him to have them for breakfast. So good job, Brayden. <clears throat> Drives me crazy sometimes. Got 60 count of a gallon freezer bag, some flushable wipes, since, you know, we do have a potty training boy and it's hard to, yeah, you know, you know. Anyways, so, and then we got some three things of brown rice. What else did we get? Got some yeast. I'm gonna try, try emphasis on the try to make some bread from scratch. Emphasis on the try. Got bananas for banana pudding and just for the boys. Watch none of these get eaten. I will be so mad. So when I get three bananas, they devour them. When I get six bananas, they just leave them. Anyways, banana pudding, if there's any leftover banana bread and then just snacks. Did I show this already? No. So we got some refried beans for, it's like a refried beans on a tortilla, sour cream, chicken, olives, and cheese. It's pretty good, so try it out. Got some salsa because I like chips and salsa, chow mein noodles for whenever we have fried rice. I've never really liked the crunchy taco shows, but I had a dream about them, and so I got them. <laughs> I don't know. Bagels, flour, potatoes, the uh, vanilla wafers for Brandon's banana pudding, sweet condensed no milk for his banana pudding, uh, vanilla pudding for his banana pudding. I know weird, but that's what they put in it. Uh, original crescents breakfast. Brandon, of course, you know broke into this I you know I can't, he can't be tamed that's all there is to it got some bread so this is what I got the piece of sauce for so I what I used to do when I was working before I had kids I used to come home from work because I worked really close slather some pizza sauce on a pita bread and put some you know cheese and pepperoni and throw it in the oven takes like five minutes take it out eat it so that's what I'm gonna do for the boys. I think they'll like that a lot, so. 
Originally, I had gotten an 80 count of the corn tortillas, but they substituted it because they didn't have it, so they gave me three of the 30 count, so I guess we're having a lot of corn tortillas. What is that, 90? Oh, well, it's not, it's about the same amount, so. But still, we're having a lot of corn tortillas. And then we're having horse, tor just regular flour. Flour tortilla, just regular flour tortillas. Because words are hard. And I don't know if I showed it, but I got some sparkling water. Usually I get to just a sparkling ice water, but they didn't have it. And that stuff is actually pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie, but it's, it's, I don't really, I'm, what are the ingredients actually? Does it contain a spiritine? Yeah, and that's why I don't like it, because it contains a spare team. So, we just don't drink a lot of it, I guess. And now we're over here. So we got the, as always, we get the premium sausage. I accidentally got the maple one one time. Ugh, that's all I gotta say, it's disgusting. Oh no, this bag is ripped. Oh crap. That sucks. We got seasoned fries. I usually get the boneless chicken breast brown skinless chicken breast but they only had the thighs so you know gotta pick my battle so i got that colby jack fiesta blend i meant to just get one and i guess i got both of them it is what it is mozzarella cheese i meant to get a bigger one i only got the small one pepperoni for the pita bread pizzas winster winster how do you say that tell me how to say that winster cheese what what okay i'm done winster sure the cheese sliced cheese Banana, strawberry, banana, what is that called? Yogurt for Brandon. Blue bonnet. I'm kind of obsessed with turkey dogs now. I don't know why. I'm just not a fan of the regular hot dogs anymore. And I feel like these are better ingredients. No added nitrates or nitrate, nitrates and nitrites. Is that two separate things? Oh, see, shows you how much I pay attention. Heavy whipping cream. I love my coffee, so I got some caramel macchiato. And look at how weird. I love it. Twinkies. Okay. Never liked the actual Twinkies, but I think I like the creamer because I like all creamer. Uh, tater tots. Brandon got some pulled pork, mac and cheese, and then beef pot roast. And then some original French toast sticks. Cinnamon. They're really good, but they're just too much sugar for me personally. I don't know. I'm sure the boys would be more than happy with the sugar, but I just don't really like them. Broccoli florets and a three pound thing of turkey. And you can tell that we haven't gone grocery shopping in a while. Look at this. My noodles are never bare. And the only reason why there's a pack of one pack of spaghetti in here is because Lamar dropped the box and it busted open. Just the top. It didn't actually fall on the floor, but the top busted open. So I'm like, well, I got to throw this in here. So I threw it in there. But before it was empty. All of it was empty. Brown rice, everything. So I'm not buying just to stock up. I'm buying because we need it have you guys look at me put away a few things if you want to i don't know if you want to but i'm gonna show it just for a few things not for everything because i'll get in my own way so contentness is it my cricket have i been cricket this entire time oh. does anyone else have a feeling of like contentness when they have groceries <laughs> something i never thought i would feel as an adult but i feel just like yay i can feed my kids <laughs> which, which obviously even if i didn't have 
you know, the groceries. I would make it work, but I just hate doing like the little in between grocery shopping, and that's what I've been doing. Like that's what I was doing for probably a month. That's not good. It's not cost effective. It's not time effective. It's not. It's just not good. So I had to get back on my groove, and that's why now we're gonna go ahead and do a Sam's Club haul. Uh, probably not today. I'm thinking it's gonna be tomorrow, so I'll probably post it Friday. Wait, what day is it? Losing track of my days, y'all. It's not good. But it'll be out because I'll definitely post it. Where did I put the rest of that flower from before? Oh. I got it. And remember, whenever you're refilling stuff, take the stuff that is older out. Put the new stuff at the bottom and then put the old stuff on top of it so that you can make sure you use the old stuff first. And I am pushing my limits with this container. We gonna close it. It's gonna close. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Y'all didn't even see it, but it was impressive. Alright, I think that's all I'm gonna show. I think that's all I'm gonna show y'all today because you know sometimes you feel like sharing your disaster. Sometimes you don't. And today is just one of the days that I don't feel like sharing my disaster. But I wanted to share this grocery haul with y'all because I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. I will talk to y'all soon. Now let me go ahead and finish putting the rest of the stuff up and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye!